Hey, what's up, Mr. Love here. Uh, right now we're going to look at a, uh, a quick little problem here, Ohm's Law and Electrical Power. Um, the two equations that relate to, uh, to this type of solution are V equals IR, that's Ohm's Law. Um, and the second equation that we're going to look at is the power equation. Power is current, or I times V, which is voltage, okay, PIV. Um, this is actually a two-step problem. Uh, let's look at what we have first. So the first thing they give us here um, is the resistance. Okay, they give us the resistance, and we're told that the resistance is equal to 25 ohms. Um, and the uh, the second thing they give us is the voltage, which is 120 volts. Okay, so if you plug this hair dryer in, it has a resistance of 25 ohms, um, and we're using 120 volts. So given this um, information, in order to solve for the power, um, we need to first find out what the current is flowing through this system. So in order to do that, we're going to use Ohm's law first. Okay, we could rearrange this algebraically to solve for I, and I is equal to V divided by R. Um, when we make that substitution, I is equal to the voltage, which is 120 volts, divided by the resistance, which is 25 ohms. Okay, when you make that um, calculation, you get a current that is equal to 4.8 amps. Okay, so now we have this I, um, and we have the voltage up here from the original given information, and we can solve for the power, okay, which is simply I times V. So um, we take this and move this up here. The power is equal to the current, which is 4.8 amps, times the voltage, which is 120 volts. Okay. Um, doing that calculation, um, you get 576 watts. Okay. And watts is the unit for electrical power. Um, and that's it. There you have a simple Ohm's Law um, electrical power problem. Thanks for watching.